What's up, Victor? Okay, thank you. Let's thank do the handshake. No, the handshake. No, they're already there. It's already yeah, on the news. Oh. <laughs> I'm not trying to do the next news thing. I'm Joel Ewing. I'm the lead theater teacher here at Sen Arts High School. I think one of our biggest things still hurdles for some of us are lines, right? Uh, today we are going to see seventh period, um, which is a combination class between juniors and seniors. So today we have to look at some fight choreography for a scene. Um, we've got some students that just advanced to the preliminary round of the August Wilson monologue competition. So we're going to be doing some monologue coaching uh, for those juniors and seniors that are advancing to that round. You ain't telling me nothing! You ain't taking this piano out of my house. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Guys, if nothing else, let it just be a different way to say this line. They're all more talented than I am, they are smarter than I am, they're uh, uh, cooler than I ever was, <laughs> for sure. Um, so I, um, I think that young people a lot of times can get a bad rap for being like disconnected or apathetic, and I see quite the contrary. I see the opposite every single day. Um, they're so socially engaged, they're politically invested, uh, they're curious about their own art and the art making of others. Um, so no, I'm taken aback every single day by a question, by a comment, by an observation, uh, by a performance. There's a little something every day that kind of like makes it worth coming back a next day just to find out what's next. We're just in class, it's not the thing yet, but like if if you're compelled like, oh, why am I sitting here now? Just go with it. See what it's like to sit in a different place. If it doesn't work, now it's like, well, now I know that doesn't work there, right? We're so big on collaboration. So working with others, uh, voicing and fighting for your own idea while also balancing the ideas of others. Uh, logistically going through the process of making something. Um, you know, we're about to do a 10 minute scene that they collaborated on, but they had to come up with a calendar for that. They had to rehearse for that. They had to devise and write that. They had to email each other about that. They had to share Google Docs. It's not that dissimilar if they were in whatever the job is, but there's so much of the collaborative spirit that happens here in this classroom setting and will immediately apply uh, beyond their time here at high school.